this lecture i am going to discuss about write a program for method without parameter but with a return type in java programming so this is the code so first here i am going to run this code now you can see the output so 26.1 that's displaying so this here that i paste this place so method without parameter so now here you can see there is a or some method so some method has no any parameter so we can write some method has no parameter okay so some method no parameter without return types okay with return types now here you can see double and there i am using return types now i am going to explain this code so if you debug the code then control comes to main method then after there i created fun cross object so fun here so you can see this is fun so fun cross object f sorry m is the fun cross object now m so new and here fun so fun is the constructor has two parameter so now that control comes to this place because fun has uh, two parameters so now this place d1 and d2 so d1 value is now here that is equal to 12.6 and d2 value is now or uh, 13.5 so this is the d1 and d2 value now after that control comes to this point so here d1 value that go to n1 so this is now n1 is now that is equal to 12.6 and n2 value is now here 13.5 and after that when that all done then control back to this position so here after that so constructor part that has been over now thereafter that i have taken add so this is now add method sorry add is the variable and m that call some method so here some method that call so now the control comes to or this point some method so m this is the object of one class that that calls some method so then after that go inside so here double so add equal to n1 plus n2 so n1 value here 12.6 and 13.5 so if you add this one so this is now 26.1 that come so here add is now equal to 26.1 and after that this returned the add so here this returned 26.1 then after that to here so after returning or this is now here control backs to this point so add value is now 26.1 after that here control goes to this point and here that display addition of two numbers equal to and then after add value so add value is now 26.1 also this a display into the output screen okay and after that when that all done then that out from the main method so this is how the code that works so this is the example of method without parameter so now you can see some method has no any parameter and with a return types so return types some with some then i'm using the double data types so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you and there is the one important things so fun cross fun so if the class name and the method names 
is the same then this call here constructor so this is not the method because class name and method name both are the same so this call constructor so constructor has the parameter so this is the constructor fun okay so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you